Guys, I think I'm getting rid of my car and using this golf cart for the rest of the year. So unless 2K releases a hoverboard, jetpack, or dirt bike, I'm gonna be cruising around with my clubs in the back and my fellows riding shotgun. I recently hit level 40 in season one and unlocked the golf cart. And I have some positives and negatives about it, but this has to be one of the most cool things that 2K has put in the game other than just playing the game of basketball. Now the golf cart, it lets you interact with your friends or randoms outside of the cart. So it's really giving me these Grand Theft Auto type of vibes. And just like in GTA, you can now have a friend hop in your golf cart and ride shotgun with you wherever you go in the city. It even has the same features to lock your doors to prevent random people from hopping in your ride. To me, it seems like 2K is slowly testing out new ways that we can interact with the environment and other players in the game. And eventually, a lot of the features that we see in GTA are gonna be in 2K. And I bet we'll be able to own our own businesses. This makes me think, proximity chat, but back to hitting level 40, back to the go-kart. Now the go-kart is fun to use, but there's a couple of things that may turn you off from using it. And one issue that I have is backing up. It seems like the cart would get stuck in reverse and I would just be sitting there floating backwards and couldn't do anything about it until gravity stopped me from moving. And this may have been because of my poor driving skills. You might not have the same problem, but for me, this was a big problem because I'm not the best driver and I have a bad habit of running into poles and walls. So the second thing is not really an issue, but it's more of a preference. With the new transit system that allows you to fast travel around the city, you probably don't ride around too much unless you just like to ride around the city. And don't get me wrong, I like riding around the city too, but your friends may not be too happy waiting for you when you guys decide to switch courts. Unless they see you when you pull up with your new ride and they decide to ride with you. So it's also good to use if you're just going around the corner to the Gatorade facility. It's always nice not to have to drive over there yourself because we all know we can get lazy sometimes. So if you don't mind getting stuck in reverse a few times, the go-kart is really fun to use. You should just try it out at least. But before we get out of here, if you guys are still trying to grind to hit level 40, make sure you keep at it, play the park, play the wreck, whatever game mode is the funnest to you and that you can play the most. I do advise playing the wreck because it does give you a ton of experience if you do well. And don't forget about those events or those double XP coins. So let me know down in the comments what you guys think about the go-kart. But that's it for now. If you enjoyed this one and learned something new, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, bang on that notification bell, and I'll catch you on the next one.